how's it keep you? So many reflections from today. Just a couple right now. First of all, I uh, swept and tidied up out here, and it's interesting. It's almost like the breeze blowing through here is fresher and cooler because I cleaned up. It's almost like Mother Nature is pleased with me and sending a cool breeze as a thank you. <laughs> She appreciates tidiness. Milking a goat. Today was the first time that I jumped. Well, first of all, the goat had leaped over a five-foot fence three times in a row before we got it corralled again. And thankfully, I had a little assistance. Thank you, Grace. And so this time, I was like, all right, I'm, I'm getting her this time. She's not getting back out. So this is the first time I ever just kind of lunged and grabbed the goat by the rear leg. So I had her by the rear leg, and then I worked my other hand up, and I grabbed her by the horn. And then I had, um, right by me, I had a, a rope with a loop at the end that I could put over the head and then tighten it down. So I'm still holding on with one horn slide it over, switch hands, tighten it, then drag her, because she doesn't like to go. She's pretty wild, this one, Jolene, <laughs> over to the milking stand and, and milk her. And first of all, I kind of surprised myself at how well I was able to grab that, that wild goat. And that's the first reflection is just go for it. Many times you're going to surprise yourself at just how awesome you are. And the second reflection is, while milking the goat, is... Hmm, you know, milking a goat is not a process that you rush. Milking anything is not a process that you rush. You sort of massage and get things loosened up, and then especially in the beginning, you don't try to do too much until you just get a little bit of a flow going, and just like life, it really teaches you to be patient. It's a meditation to sit and milk a goat, milk a cow. It really is, and, and another moment where you, if you allow yourself, you can really feel really close to God. So, uh, yeah, don't rush it. Don't force it. Take your time. You know, figure it out. Massage it. Find different angles. <laughs> Let it flow. And surprise yourself. Have a great day.